You may have noticed these signs popping up on the I-94 corridor from the Indiana-Michigan state line to east of the I-69 interchange. They will soon display information that is directed at truck drivers, but aimed at making the roadway safer for all motorists. It's notorious for uh, heavy traffic. It, it, it's extremely heavy truck traffic on that route. Uh, we've had for years problems with trucks uh, parking on the shoulders, parking on the on ramps and off ramps. During a three year study of this route, 65 crashes were linked to driver fatigue or trucks being parked where they shouldn't be. For truck drivers, the problem is often finding an open parking space to safely stop and rest. Because all the parking spots are full. The driver's already out of hours, he don't want to be on the road. What options he has, not a lot of options. Special grant funding from the Federal Highway Administration is helping the Michigan Department of Transportation address the problem. The truck parking information and management system will soon be online. What we're trying to do is get those truckers to safe locations, which will ultimately improve the safety of the motoring public. Five rest areas and 10 private truck stops are participating, providing more than 1,100 parking spaces. The problem isn't a lack of spaces, it's making sure truck drivers know where those open spaces are. It allows the truck driver to receive the information in a safe manner, which allows them to make a more well-informed decision as to if they press on or stop at the next available location. Besides the signs, there are two websites dispatchers can access to relay that information to the drivers. An app is also available, allowing drivers to receive the information in an audible form as they travel. Oh, if you know where, uh, like if you have multiple options, that just opens up a really wide variety of options and really helpful. In the future, the system may be implemented in other areas with high commercial vehicle traffic with the goal of reducing crashes, injuries and fatalities.